cutting models using the swap top diamond trim saw. We're going to cut a wine bottle down today for another project. We set up the trim saw with a diamond blade. We're using the fence as a guide. We raise the blade guard high enough so that it just will clear the bottle diameter. And we set the drip rate for one to two drops per second. We're going to turn the saw on to about three quarter speed. We're going to start by keeping the base of the bottle against the fence and slowly roll the bottle into the blade. Once it starts cutting, we're going to push the bottle forward. And we're going to let the diamond blade cut through the bottom of our bottle. When it starts to come out the bottom, we're going to stop in position and start rotating the bottle towards us as we gently keep feeding it into the blade. Basically, you're spinning the bottle on axis. The blade will then cut as you turn the bottle around in a circle. It's important that as you're cutting, if you notice a white powder or paste forming, to increase the drip rate. You never want to use your diamond blade dry. It's the fastest way to ruin it. So we're going to continue slowly letting the saw do the work. Spinning the bottle into the blade. And as we come around, you'll be able to see the start cut. And as you come back to your beginning, you're going to really ease up on the pressure. Let the blade do the work so you don't get a breakout at the end. And just about through. I'm going to really slow down. Just barely push into the blade. There we go. There's our top. Turn off the saw. And there's our cut bottle ready for our next project.